Hello and welcome to Be Madden Revit Tutorials. In today's tutorial, I would like to show you how to create these different shapes of viewports, how to change colors of viewports, and how to change height of the lines from crop views. Uh, here you can see the sheet where I where I placed the different uh, shapes uh, of different details and I changed the color white and color uh, the line white and lines colors. Here you can see red lines, black lines. You can change the color of the line uh, as you wish when I show you the method how to do this. Now let me show you how to create first how to create these shapes here we have circular shapes of the viewports i create uh, these ones using call out tool and now i will show you also how you can change the color of this window here this is the way now you can change it in the color you want just to show you how the colors of cut patterns looks like and now i will change it to the white all right the white is the color i usually use All right, and now I will show you. This is the call out tool. Uh, we usually use them to create details. And now I will show you how to create it. For example, go to view, uh, select the call out tool. You have rectangular, or you can use uh, by sketch drawing by sketch now i will click on this uh, call out part here and now i will change the shape of it by by selecting this i will select this part here and i will edit it uh, i will edit the shape of it i will choose this uh, part here and the maximum the maximum says uh, 36 and when we draw it with 36 part it will looks like a, a circular shape all right that is how we draw them and here it is now i'll hide this section here all right and that's it now I will go to the sheet. This is axonometric and is a, and isometric presentation and this is our sheet. And now I will place this new detail I created to the sheet. All right. That's it. Now I will show you how to create this is our house small village house this is the roof presentation I will later I will create the tutorial how to model this roof structure also but now uh, uh, just to show you how to create different shapes of uh, of uh, this villa details now which part should we show we go to call out tool and using sketch we can draw shape any shape we we want all right let's see it be something like this as I said, it can be uh, the shape you wish. Actually, I will delete it. I will use rectangular 
tool and now by selecting the corners I will create something like this a little bit here and that's it now I will go to the sheet and I will place this new create detail here you can see the shape is totally different <laughs> than others all right i will show you one well, before that i need to hide this section here and i will show you one uh, shape more then i will show you how to change the colors and the line whites of these crop views from here all right we will go to ground floor and now I will choose this part here all right and I will create this hexagonal shape now I will go to the sheet and I will put our hexagonal shape detail to the sheet all right our section is visible here also and i will hide it all right that's it all right as you can see here we have different shapes and all numbers of these details are visible in the ground floor plan and now i will draw one shape more uh, which part to draw which part maybe this part here all right we can show the doors for example now i will scale this triangle uh, maybe the best is to show the part of the roof here with triangle all right just this is enough this is the part that will be visible in the detail part of the view and now i'm going to the sheet where i will place this new shape from the section all right that's it that's it this shape is placed also but i will hide the levels and the grid lines because i don't want them to be visible in this part of the view all right now dear friends i will show you how to change the line wide and line color of this crop view here by going in this detail you click the uh, right click and go to change graphic visibility graphics by the element and by selecting these parameters you can change the uh, line color line white and line type all right also you can 
edit the shape of this view here all right i will delete now these triangle lines and that's it okay by clicking on your uh, on the arrows left right up down arrows you can move the elements from this region here the region will, will stay uh, in on the same place but the elements that are visible on this part of the view will move up or down it can be it can be very useful uh, tips when you want to change the only place that are visible in the view but you want the view to stay in the same place all right now i will change the colors of this part here to red i will change the line type the color of the line and the line white that's it now we have red lines here one more example i will change this to to red and the line whites will be all right that's it all right dear friends that's all for this tutorial please don't forget to subscribe and to share my words with your friends and colleagues see you in the next tutorial